Welcome back to another episode of Skyrim. Azura has seen your coming, traveler. It was not curiosity, but fate that has led you here. Oh. Cool. This shrine was built by the Dunmer. As our land was scorched by fire and brimstone, Azura's prophecies led us to safety. She is a Daedra. I'm a terrible a Dunmer. Being who watches from beyond our mortal plane. She has chosen you to be her champion. Okay. You must go to a fortress endangered by water, yet untouched by it. Inside, you will find an elven mage who can turn the brightest star as black as night. It is cryptic, I know, but Azura's signs are never wrong. I believe the fortress may refer to Winterhold. Ask if they know this elven enchanter. Uh, you all alone here? Yes, there were others at first, but Azura's visions tested everyone's faith. One by one, they left, afraid to know their own future. But I refuse to abandon the shrine. The visions are a gift. Azura warns me of tragedy, war, death. Before it happens, I won't leave her guidance. Hmm. Twilight, guide your path. Oh, well. There was a dragony dragony thingy dingy over here. I think it's prudent. We look at that too. Oh. Do 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 do. Oh, you would. So this one is a fire dragon. Someone wants to be my friend, that never happens. No. Just no. Know that I said no is what I'm saying. I don't know why these dragons are seeking me out one by one. They're falling. It seems it seems counterproductive to their mission statement. The fool horsey. That reminds me of my horse. My horse was more beautiful, though.
Alright, it probably has an altar. We'll take a look. Dovakin! Kindova! That was like the sim language. Uma, uma shima shima sha. Shepshi. Ska eke. As boost. Away with you. I think I found a path. The path to freedom. And magic. Oh, foxes lead the way. I gotcha. Mm. So, Mount Anfor. I'll keep it lab. Hmm. You don't say. I recall his force to face. Huh, Windhelm. Oh, it's that way. That's close. That's like this way. Then I'll just go up there and I'll travel down the mountain. That's cool. I warned you with several lightning bolts, but you chose to ignore my warnings, and you paid the ultimate price. Ah, I like this area though, with the heavy snowfall. Reminds me... I don't even know what it reminds me of. Not of home. I, we don't have such a mountainous landscape. Uh... <sighs> but, uh, it looks good. It looks good. Now you just need those virtual reality goggles, right? To really become one with the world. I see it. But no, I don't, actually. Oh my... F really? How'd you die from that? Sometimes I don't understand him. Sometimes. It's like... Hey... He's fallen... Way, from way higher than that, and lived. So I ask you... I ask you... What the fuck? I need a horse. I'm on a horse. Need a horse. Lead a horse. Did I get it? Do I have to go up there again? I got it. Ooh. 
La, 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 Lords of Winter. Hear my name. Da, da. Let's go to the... Yeah, we had that quest anyway from Asura. They'll probably be like, hey. And I'll be like, hey. Hey. <sighs> Oh, the dragon's moving again. Shenanigans. All right. Tolthia. You would know. You always know these things. I still can't believe it. You, the archmage, never would have guessed it. Lead the way. Follow me. And die. I need your help with something. Something private. All right then. Eh, quiet. Jazargo. Can you, can you possibly help Jazargo? Mm hmm. Perhaps we can go another few decades without a disaster. That would be nice. Ancano is exactly why we're so restricted. Is there an elven mage here who studies the stars? Did you say an elf and stars? I hope you don't know what you're asking. Uh, what is it? What happened? There was an unfortunate incident a few years ago. An elven mage named Nelikar was exiled from the college over it. He's uh. still in town, getting by, plying spells to the people inside the frozen hearth. Disgraceful. Alright. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Whoop. <clears throat> well, serious business. You're gonna be my tank, okay? Still here. Oh, That's I can trade things way. with you too? Heh, <laughs> bitchin'. I wonder if I can get like a war band. Or more than one person, you know? Hmm. You're that one from the college. You don't say. I need to talk to you. Unless you're bringing Greetings, me another Archmage. Boop. Who sent you? Was it the college? The Jarl? We agreed there would be no more questions. A priestess of Sora sent me. You're working with the Daedra? Right. Now tell me the one about the Argonian maid and the lusty baron. Damn it. A few coins for my soul. If only you understood the irony. What do you know about soul gems? Why are you asking? That's what caused all the trouble. Soul gems are used in enchanting, but they break afterwards. Except one. Azura's star. A Daedric artifact that allows any number of souls to pass through it. Some of us wanted to find out how. I was working under Malin Varan then. If only we knew what he was really planning. Malin wanted to alter the star. He was dying. Disease. He thought he could store his own soul inside. Become immortal. It drove him mad. Students started dying. Eventually, the college exiled him. He took a few loyal disciples to Ilan Alter's deep and vanished. Look, I don't care who asked you to find the star, but don't take it back to Azura. The Daedra are evil. They're the reason Malin went insane. 
How did Daedra drop down insane? Azora is no ordinary Daedra. She commands an entire realm inside of Oblivion. The more Malin worked on the star, the more she was able to damn him. It started slowly at first. Malin would see things that weren't there. Then he would yell at students over words they hadn't said. Then one day I walked in and Malin had killed a student. And in a horrific moment of inspiration, he started using her soul for his work. Hmm. The college would agree with you. But do you have any idea how many innocent lives were cut short just so Azura could have revenge? We're nothing to the Daedra. Pawns to move around, praise and punish as they see fit. I mentioned how the star is a soul gem, only it never gets depleted. There's another rule the artifact follows. You can only store white souls in the star belonging to the lesser creatures. Azura's magic won't allow black souls to enter it. As a mortal, Malin's soul was black, so part of his work was breaking past Azura's rules. He was close before. Well, I already told you. Hmm. Mm hmm. All right. Well, that answers that. The Black Star. Oh, that's a bit of waste. <sighs> I'll go to Kindsgrove, go from there to Windhelm. Freaking Spriggans. They attacked me. With weird stuff. Alright. Here we go. Travel. Travel. Oop. Oh, Oops. Sorry. You can summon Antronax? Sweet. Atronax. Anti stuff. How can you grow anything in this cold and snowy weather? Because I see a sickle and hay. This kind of reminds me of the, the bridge from Cyrodiil. Except, it wasn't as tall. That was a cool bridge. Um, anyways. Or, whatever the, the middle city is called in Oblivion. I don't remember exactly. Is it called Cyrodiil? I think it is Cyrodiil. Cyrodiil Dil Dil. Rawr. He's angry. He's got reason to be. But he still shouldn't be so angry. Angry. Of all the Ottomans, the Piava Asian Dreamer. You come here where you're not wanted. You eat our food, you pollute our city with your stink. And you refuse to help the Stormcloaks. But we haven't taken a side because it's not our fight. Hey, maybe the reason these Grayskins don't help in the war is because they're Imperial spies. Imperial spies? You can't be serious. Maybe we'll pay you a visit tonight, little spy. We got ways of finding out what you really are. <sighs> Looking for shipping? We always offer better service than the East Empire Company. Okay. What the fig you're a spy? Some of these nords will come up with any excuse to despise us. And it isn't just the Dark Elves they hate. 
they make a target of the Argonians as well. Hmm. In fact, just about anyone who isn't a Nor aim for their bullying. Alright. Well that's not cool. Then it's true what everyone is saying. That Aventus Aretino is doing the Black Sacrament, trying to summon the Dark Brotherhood? Oh, Grimbar. Always with the nonsense. Mm. Well, it looks like... We'll have to wait. Oh, of course not. Those are just... Fine. Things. Then I'll invite him out to play. He lives right there. I'm going to knock on his door. No, child. Wait! That boy. That house. They are cursed. Ha! Huh, then I'm right. I knew it. He's trying to have somebody killed. All right. I won't deny it, child. What you heard is true. But Aventus Aretino walks a dark path. His actions can lead only to ruin. Now, enough. We will speak no more of this. I am the only friend you need. Yeah. I don't know what to say about say about that. I'm the only friend you need. Blah, blah, blah. Here we go. Sweet mother, sweet mother, send your child unto me, for the sins of the unworthy must be baptized in blood and fear. Please, how long must I do this? I keep praying, Night Mother. Why won't you answer me? Sweet Mother, sweet Mother, send your child unto me, for the sins of the unworthy must be baptized in blood and fear. Hey. Finally! My prayers have been answered! Nope. It worked! I knew you'd come! I just knew it! I'm not a chick. The black sacrament over and over with the body and the things. Oh. And then you came, an assassin from the Dark Brotherhood. Um. Remain silent. You don't have to say anything. There's no need. You're here, so I know you'll accept my contract. Contract? My mother, she, she died. I, I'm all alone now. So they sent me to that terrible orphanage in Riften. Honor Hall! The headmistress is an evil, cruel woman. They call her Grella the kind. But she's not kind. She's terrible to all of us! So I ran away and came home and performed the Black Sacrament. Now you're here and you could kill Grella the kind! Please hurry. To be honest, I'm kind of lonely here. As much as I hated getting sent to Honor Hall, I really miss my friends there. Uh, oh, okay. It's a cool person. It's cool. Innocence lost. Riften, you say? And yeah, they say they're saying Riften. That's gonna be a walk too, jeez. The horses in Skyrim are hardy and strong. And make up for endurance. And make up for it in endurance what they lack in speed. Hmm, that's what I have to say about that. Uh, uh. Mm. Yes, yes, loading, loading. Hey. <sighs> There we go. A quick 
cut off the episode and it cleared it all up. Oop. Swim. Man, it would be freezing if you came out of the water like that. Just like la 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 la. And especially this kind of clothing, the water just sticks to it. And it weighs you down. You'd probably weigh like 10, 15 pounds more. With the kind of clothing I'm wearing. I don't know. You'd weigh a lot more. Just the water would just completely soak. And just absorb all the water like a sponge. Would not be cool. Oop. Ah, yep. Just traveling. It's gonna be sweet when I discover like a lot of locations that are close by to like everything, you know? That looks like it hurt. Ah, crap. Hmm. I'll drop that. There we go. Ba da ba da ba ba da ba ba ba. different kind of landscape. A spriggan. And these guys. Yeah. You can do your thing, I'm gonna do my thing. Not being near you. Is what I'm saying. Not that I don't want to, but that I am on important business. Ugh, timer's almost up. See, this is what I'm saying. Like, boom. Timer gone. Timer gone. It's like, where does the time go? Mostly spent traveling. Don't start forest fires. I'm going to... Oh! Boop. 
boop. Hold there. Before I let you into Riften, you need to pay the visitor's tax. What's the tax for? For the privilege of entering the city. What does it matter? This is obviously a shakedown. It's not gonna work. Right. Keep your voice down. Yeah, okay. You want everyone to hear you? I'll let you in. Just let me unlock the gate. Thank you. First persuasion. That has worked. God oh, damn it. I swear. Gates unlocked. Welcome Head to Rift. when you're ready. Oh, thieves. Ugh. Man, it makes me angry. I had another run in with a thief's guild. Be careful, Mio. The thieves' guild has Maven Blackbriar. I don't know you. You and Riften looking for trouble. Fingers and you could end up in Riften jail. <sighs> I'm not scared of you. That's the wrong answer. I can't just Last thing the Blackbriars need around here is some troublemaker trying to steal a piece of the action. What Blackbriars? The Blackbriars have Riften in their pocket, and the Thieves Guild watching their back. So keep your nose out of their business. Me? I'm Maul. I watch the streets for them. If you need dirt on anything, I'm your guy. But it'll cost you. Got any dirt on this? Only way you could have found one of those is by stealing it. Guess you'll fit in around here better than I thought. So what do you want to know? Uh, nothing. Be seeing you around. Be I'm seeing you. Tired of your excuses. Please, please, I need but a septum. A septum is all I ask. All right, can we get to the place? I have a lot of respect for the restoration school. Skyrim. Yeah, there we go. Hello. All right. Well, that's the episode. So, thanks for watching, guys. Leave a comment and tune into the next.